it's your girl Janisha John, and you are here at the Baddies Caribbean premiere, and you're locked into Great Tea News. Let's get into it, y'all. The cabaret is cabaret. The cabaret is cabaret. Y'all, why did Jocelyn have this girl? Uh, y'all know on the Jocelyn's Cabaret show, they be twerking, dancing, they're, they're exotic dancers, strippers, whatever, right? Y'all, why they got this girl twerking and her trick is her farting a dollar in the air? Y'all... Y'all heard me right. Yeah, yeah, I know y'all like, what the hell Great T just say? Y'all heard me. Embarrassing when you was embarrassing your relationship. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Right. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Lord have mercy. Check this out, y'all. Fair use. What just happened? What just happened? <laughs> Bruh. Bro. That's crazy. Bruh, that's disgusting. I don't care what y'all say. What the hell? Nigga, did you know that I can see you? What? What? Come on, man. I I just I. Bitches. Ew. Disgust. Ew. Ew. Oh my lord. Uh, like, all right. Uh, 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 cootie cat. The tissy popping on a handstand. Tissy popping. Tissy. Tissy popping. Tessie poppin', Tessie, Tessie poppin', Tessie poppin', Tessie, Tessie poppin', Tessie poppin', Tessie fartin' on a handstand. Y'all, Tessie fartin' on a handstand? Y'all, I thought I saw everything. I, I, we get upstage every single day. Every time I think I saw something that, like, the most just lowest, you know what I'm saying, most vile disgusting low vibrational stuff y'all zeus hey zeus got it zeus zeus didn't got it they got an exotic dancer show this girl popping it on the headstand and then farted the dollar in the air y'all what the hell the 12 2015 yes okay um and uh have you been changed in any way according uh based on what's in front of you no okay uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. Uh, Dirty. She's trashy. She's slutty. Yeah, I. Uh, y'all, y'all know it's very rare, okay? All right, y'all know it's very rare for me to be speechless. I, I, they got me. Zeus got me. I don't know what the hell to say. I, I just, you know. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Dirty money. Put a helicopter in the chat. Put a helicopter in the chat. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Stop. That's crazy. Oh my lord! I'm I'm just I'm done, y'all. I I just <laughs> all I can do is laugh. All I can do is laugh, man. Um, yeah, man. You said is that a party trick? Anybody ever seen? No, I've never seen that. Yeah, I know that dollar stank. I know that dollar stank. All right. <sighs> if blowing money was a person, I got money to blow. Uh oh oh. Oh, I'm done. I'm sorry, y'all. I, I got to get past that. The cabaret be cabaret, y'all. That's all. I, I didn't even want to review anymore. After I saw that, I said, I'm going to just let Jocelyn have it. I'm going to let Jocelyn have it, y'all. Um, Especially, um, I will give them their credit. 
if you watch Jocelyn's Cabaret right now, y'all, them girls be fighting. They be fighting. I, I'll give them. I think the fights on Jocelyn's Cabaret is is top notch compares to uh, Baddie's Caribbean. We gonna have to see with Baddie's Midwest, but right now the Jocelyn girls, the new girls and stuff, they got they, they take the cake. But farting dollars in the air, yeah, I. They got it. They got it. I'm done, man. The cabaret be cabaret, y'all. The cabaret be cabaret. Now we got to get into the baddies. Let's talk about this, okay? Now, I don't know why they don't just admit it. Um, y'all know Janisha has been throwing shade at towards uh, Lemmy and Scotty. A lot of people has been throwing subliminals. Um, you know, they don't even hide it, you know? Lemmy was seen what last week didn't we cover it y'all when they was fighting the club and the only person lemmy was caring about was the, for security to save was scotty he was like man i'll pay y'all for a reason man get scotty do your job go get scotty where's scotty at i said damn you know and he had jasmine R renee right next to him which make me give him the side eye too because it's like what did that girl do to get get a damn chain already Okay, but anyways, um, you can tell throughout the entire um reunion that there was some form of tension between Scotty and Janisha, even if they wanted didn't want to tackle it. Okay, so this was a funny little clip. All right, shout out to Coop Clues. They said, Do you think Lemmy told Scotty to chill out? Yeah, because if you watch the reunion, she was kind of doing a little too much. Okay, and then all of a sudden she got a text message and she calmed down. All right, check this out. Fair use. It said, damn, she definitely got a text from Lemmy telling her to chill. Look, she was doing her big one. Talking her ish, popping her ish. You feel me? Showing the body, twerking. She got a text message. Look at her face. Look. Look at her face. I never noticed this, y'all. Scotty looked like um, Princess Fiona from Shrek. And I'm not talking about... I'm talking about the real Princess Fiona, not when she was human. Hold on. Princess Fiona Shrek. So y'all trying to tell me... Hold on. I'm, I'm talking about just, just the face. I don't know. It, it, it's giving Princess Fiona... Is giving Princess Fiona. Hold on, y'all never notice. Uh, uh, Scotty look like Princess Fiona. All right, <laughs> that that's that's the vibe that I got. Okay, Ch check out, watch, watch when they do the um, watch when they do the uh, what's the name again? The, the close up look, especially when she do that little sad face. Watch, hold on. Let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Look, she do the little twerking. She get that alleged text from Lemmy. Bruh. Hey, now. You're a rock star. Get your game on. Go play. Hey, now. You're a rock star. Get your show on. Get laid. All right. Come on, man. Only shoot in stars. Make the road. Come on, man. Y'all know y'all see it. Y'all trying to say y'all don't see it? Do, do not act stupid and say that you don't see it. Hey, now, you're a rock star. I mean, that's just what I see. All right? <laughs> that's what I see. I don't think the Bob is uh, helping either. All right? Scotty's a good-looking woman, but I don't know what it was. It's this close-up. All of a sudden, all I see is Princess Fiona. All I see is Princess Fiona. Anyways, so the rumor is that uh, Lemmy sent her a text, and then she she kind of calmed down. She was doing a little much twerking, you know what I'm saying? And I'll, look, Princess Fiona. Look, she in her feelings now. Look at her. Okay, anyways, check this out. Scotty got something to say she, she i ain't gonna lie scotty been popping it late lately y'all ain't noticed that 
it, it, it's something about you know once these rumors about these women dealing with uh Lemmy allegedly, <clears throat> Anna and Scotty, um, I feel like they've been just been popping it a little bit, a little more. Okay, they've been popping it. All right, so she says, I don't care how y'all feel. I can do whatever I want on that stage. At least y'all talking about me. Wasn't she just said? Wasn't she just saying that she go sue people? She don't want nobody talking about her. Shut up. Blah blah blah. All right. She went from um trick daddy to um Destiny's child. Okay. She went to. She went from uh huh. Okay. What's up? Shut up. Uh huh. Okay. What's up? Shut up. To now, all of a sudden, say my name, say my name when Lemmy is around me. Say, Anna, you love me. You ain't running game. All right. She didn't, hey, she didn't switch it up. And this isn't a matter of days. Now she popping it. Now she want to be talked about. Girl, pick, you got to pick and choose. It, 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 it's given bipolar. Oh, it's up and down. You want us to talk about you or you don't want us to talk about you? You keep talking, man. And you shut the fuck up. Huh? Right. Just say what we want. Uh, really shut up when you think about fuck it. Up. Anywho, check this out. So look. It's so easy. Y'all y'all got to understand, man. Sometimes it, it's just body language. People don't have to say anything. You can read their body language, their facial expressions, their gestures, okay? It's a whole aura. It's a vibe all the time, right, okay? So, Janisha wanted these cards, right? The placing cards um, that she reads from, right? On for the baddies reunion, you know, you've seen this with a uh, talk show host literally for decades. It could be the Ricky Lake show, it could be Oprah, The View, don't matter. Wendy Williams, they all got their placing cards, right? Um, so apparently Scotty had them. Janisha just said, Hey, give me the cards. Scotty being petty as hell and putting them down and not handing it to her, just being messy, just petty as hell. Look. It's the little things, okay? Look. Girl, give me the damn cards. Girl. What, come on. Y'all see it. Messy, messy, messy. We miss nothing, man. Shout out to the bloggers. We don't miss nothing. The 12, 2015. Yes. Okay. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way for you? Uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. Okay. So that's what she was reacting to. She was like, at least y'all talking about me. Look, somebody said, but she be quick to cry and play the victim. And she do. Y'all got to keep in mind that the majority of the baddies are birds in real life. Therefore, her actions and words don't surprise me. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, she got a point there. I, hey, I... I gotta agree with her. I, I can't even I can't even disagree. So let, let let's actually give this person in the comment section their credit. Message. Okay. Um somebody says, I'm starting to hate Scotty. She's becoming a mean girl, and I hate that. Becoming. Okay. Girl, shut up. That's why they hid your passport. Had you crying. Uh-oh. Janisha needs to put her foot down, uh, the F down. Mm. I know this ain't the same Scotty that be acting like she the spokeswoman for girl power. Mmm. This why I can't get into her. Uh that <laughs> uh I'm sorry, y'all. Uh I can get into her. <laughs> you get it? Um intercourse. <laughs> Shut up, y'all. Y'all slow. You ain't gonna under, understand everything. And everything ain't meant for you to understand. I'm funny. Leave me alone. <laughs> but uh, somebody says, uh, Scotty, girl, 
Bayou is just whining on the internet about fans creating their own narratives and now you don't care or whatever. Right. Th I just said that. I just said that. Scotty, you irked me so bad. Now I used to like you, but you starting to piss me off. Um, it doesn't stop there. Scotty got a lot to say. Y'all want to hear Scotty with the body? Okay, y'all want to hear Scotty with the body? Okay. Uh Scotty, she's a thotty yaddy 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 thotty yaddy 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 yaddy. All right. Anyways, let's see what Scotty got to say. I want to first say, I think Janisha did a fantastic job hosting the reunion. Y'all, before we even read the rest of this, girl, we know this is obviously disingenuous. This is clearly disingenuous. The 12, 2015. Yes. Um, and uh, have you been changed in any way for you, uh, based on what's in front of you? No. Okay. Uh, Your Honor, at this time, the state now moves to admit. First. If you don't get that bullshit out of my face, bitch. Oh, okay. Second, the last clip was taken out of context. I was pretty lit that night. Oh, I'm sure. Oh, they they want to blame it on the uh, 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 alcohol. Okay, when all fails, blame it on the Don Julio. Baddie, 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 shut the clock. No, baddie, baddie, shut the clock. It's always baddie, baddie, shut the clock. Okay. All right, Scotty. <coughs> um, They asked me to put the cards down, so I did. I was paying more attention to Roly and E.T. talk it out. While I was putting the cards down, I can see how it looks, but even... Uh, after she picked them up, you can see she said, thank you. Thank you. And I said, you welcome. And I pointed at the cards. I know the type of person that I am. I am very kind hearted. I wasn't being mindful of my actions that night because of the liquor. And there was so much going on. Maybe I need to think less. LOL. So I'm more aware of my actions. I know how that can make me look. I love my fans, and I hope you guys can understand my heart. <sighs> you keep talking, man. And you shut the fuck up. Huh? She acting like we ain't got two eyes, y'all. We, we, we all saw that, right? Nigga, did you know that I can see you? Oh, my Lord. I just... Okay. You know. Anyways, are, are, are y'all accepting this? Let's see what they say. Now she playing victim. Now that the fans clocking her. But it was just you could do what you want, child. Scotty, don't backtrack now. Stand on it. Right. Let me tell her to write this. <laughs> Let me probably wrote it. The girl really gave two different responses on two different apps. Right. Right. She talking her ish on Twitter. Right. Talking about, uh, y'all keep my name in y'all mouth. Talk about it. Now you go on, uh, with a whole, you go on your stories on Instagram with a whole, um, uh, essay, you know, unpopular opinion. I think Scotty is genuinely a nice person and fans just take things out of context on purpose because they don't like her for some reason. Oh my Lord. Somebody says this clock it. Or she's a mean girl and only apologizing because her boo thing, Lemmy told her to. She definitely meant uh, what she said on the previous Shade video. Thank you. Somebody with some sense. What is up with this, y'all? Just say that y'all like the girl and y'all don't care about how she act. Okay? It's giving mean girls. It's giving, Rach, uh, it's giving Regina George. It's giving fetch. It's, it's not fetch. Okay? I said what I said. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. Uh, she just gave us three different personalities in two in two seconds. One minute she don't care. Okay. Next minute she do care. Everybody making fake narratives. Now she saying that you know she loved Janisha. She did a good job. Girl, pick and choose. Pick, 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 pick your poison. Chill. No, chill for what? Who is this nigga? <laughs> Ah, uh, anywho, I'm t I'm tired of Scotty. I am tired of Scotty. Okay, so uh, let's keep it going. All right. Um. 
we got Scotty right here and Lemmy, okay? Um, and it says Lemmy and Scotty both say that they're trying to find themselves. Uh, mm. y'all really just be playing with the audience like we stupid out here, okay? They think they must think we Natalie. Like I'm a real psycho, crazy bitch. Like I go dumb. I know you don't. I know you don't believe that. I know you don't believe that. That's why I'm not jumping. That's why just Scotty just. <sighs> here we go. I'm finding me. Cheers. Cheers. Oh. And I'm finding me too. Oh, well, I'm finding me. Hey, Princess Fiona is finding herself. All right. And we can't even say Lemmy is Shrek. So somehow, some way, um, you know, I, I, we own cheaters right now. This is Baddies um cheaters track edition okay we got we got uh princess fiona having an affair with donkey okay lemmy is donkey he's the donkey scotty is um princess fiona okay when she when she's the ogre all right <laughs> and for the people that get all sensitive what you trying to say scotty Scotty, a pretty girl. She got the body. Uh, look, uh, if you look closely, Princess Fiona was thick too. If 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 you look on both, uh, when she's the human form and when she's uh the ogre, uh, body T, pick your poison. When she's human, she got the model figure. Okay. When she's the Shrek, uh, when she's the ogre, uh, form, she she thick. So w don't do that. Cheers! Cheers! Oh. And I'm finding me too. Oh, well, Listen, guys. Look at Lemmy. All right, we finding everything. We finding everything. I bet. I bet y'all. Y'all find y'all. Y'all find each other in the damn bedroom together. Allegedly. All right. I'm. I'm just hoping y'all being safe. Find the rubbers too. Find the rubbers. Anyways, um, let's read the comments. Scotty said she on whatever her man on. That's what it sounds like. It's Natalie for me. Oh, well, good, good. I didn't even realize she said that. Scotty pushing him to uh, publicize them, and he obviously trying to drag it out a little longer. Oh, Scotty, never beating them allegations. Look, he had to come back and try to clear it up. Scotty being bold now, but she better know what goes around comes around. Uh oh. I thought he was coming out. Wait, wait, wait. What you mean? Come, what you mean coming out? She following him. Okay. I forgot that's her daddy. Lemon pepper juice. He sounds so fruity. Dang, for a day. <laughs> Man, y'all calling uh Lemmy a uh, juicy fruit? Zesty lemon pepper? Y'all ain't right. Y'all ain't right. <laughs> Bitch. Y'all is not right, man. It is do uh do let me be giving zesty to y'all. He be giving zesty. I don't like Scotty anymore. Dang, nobody likes Scotty. Embarrassing. <laughs> Man, hey, everybody that switched on Scotty. I'm finding me. you Cheers. Cheers. I'm finding me too. Listen, guys. Yeah, so um, y'all let me know in the chat if y'all believe that Scotty and Lemmy are uh, uh, hooking up. Okay, um, I I think so though. I don't know. Okay, you know, allegedly. Um, now nah, that's just a hat. Uh, Lemmy's from Detroit. Lemmy is from Detroit. But um, y'all know I'm gonna keep y'all updated with this whole little love triangle. Uh, or my bad, love square. Oh my bad. Damn. What what's a five? Uh, what's the five shape, y'all? It's not an octagon. That's four. I mean, that's eight, obviously. 
What what's the five size shape? Hold on, five size. Oh, a pentagon. Okay, it's it, 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 it's the pentagon. Okay, I'm gonna keep y'all. Uh, I'm gonna keep y'all updated with the pentagon. Y'all might be like, "What you talking about, Grape T? Um, let me. Okay, Scotty allegedly, Janisha, of course, Anna Mac allegedly. Okay, and uh, uh, Natalie allegedly. So uh, the love pentagon is not is not a love triangle. It is a love pentagon. <clears throat> okay. Anywho, that's why we have um, that's why we have uh Google, y'all, because I I didn't know. I forgot. I used to know all those all those shapes and stuff as a kid, and then you realize as an adult, you are never. This is stuff you will never go use in your life. Y'all paying these bills, living life, <clears throat> okay, living life as an adult. I've never had to know the damn shapes, and quiet is kept. All, all, all you really need is basic math too. You ain't you don't need all this calculus, algebra, geometry to count a damn check. All right, I didn't see people with no high school diploma make sure they uh, they get every coin on that paycheck. They know what's missing. All right, what Smokey say, y'all? This ain't enough. Whoa, 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 whoa. this ain't enough. Okay. Uh, y'all, I've never had to use the pentagon, hexagon, trapezoid. I never had to use any of that stuff. All right. And personally, I was always an English guy. English was my favorite. Um, English was my favorite uh, subject back in school. I could write an essay. I was, you know, I majored in journalism. So, hey, ain't it crazy how the world uh, come around? Anyways. I love, you know, I was always writing papers and essays and, you know, biographies. I, I was, I was really good with stuff like that. Social studies too, uh, to a certain extent, but yeah, I was always an English guy. All right. But anyways, the baddies is fighting. <clears throat> well, my bad. J.O. is fighting. All right. Uh, Biggie just getting slapped and getting punched and not doing nothing. All right. Uh, I'm not giving nobody clout. I'm not giving nobody clout. Uh, I'm the big Dominican. I'm, I got money. Y'all broke. Y'all just chasing, uh, chasing clout. Okay. All right. I'm not going to do anything. I don't have to fight. I don't have to fight nobody. I don't have to fight nobody. Girl, you on the show where it's known for fighting. And you saying that you ain't got to fight nobody? Before we even get into it. Girl, shut up. Fuck it out. We talking about a little baby. And his restaurant. Fuck little baby and his restaurant. Nigga, I'm talking about kids. You talking about me eating at somebody's fucking restaurant? You should be embarrassed. Embarrassment when you was embarrassed in your relationship. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. Right. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. And Lemmy and Natalie, y'all are fired for keep bringing this girl on the show. Why is she on the show? Sir, um, Mr. Copeland, um... Is it your desire to release your counsel at this point in time? She fired. She's fired. Okay. So I, I'm thinking. I'm starting to think Biggie got some form of evidence to blackmail Natalie and Lemmy uh, to keep being bring, uh, to keep being brought back on the show because it makes no sense. It literally makes no sense. But anyways, it says Jo explains to Biggie why she laid hands on her. When she came out onto the reunion stage, okay. Uh, if you guys didn't know, remember Biggie jumped in when um, I think when Big Kiva fought DTB was that it, y'all? Y'all let me know. And she was laughing at Meatball when she, you know, pulled out the the you know the sharp object, talking about she go slice her and all of that stuff. She getting sent home. She was being messy, laughing at all that stuff, okay. Like she is just, she's just, she's annoying, y'all. Let's be honest, y'all. Biggie is annoying. Dig back, dig back, dig back, dig back. Down my back is loaded up with snacks and different foods. Squeeze into this tiny shirt, my big back has no room. Okay. 
So check this out. Fair use. You was ruined for us at one point, then you won at one point, another point. But then for who are you to jump in somebody's fight when you don't want to be fighting in the first place? Even though I wasn't there, I was there. Them is I feel like she clocking tea. I am just already. Already. She said what she said. Okay. You don't want to fight, period. So you got the nerve to be jumping in? Oh, no. <clears throat> so she stood on business and she punched her right in her face. And Biggie didn't want to fight. My bitches, like a ride for y'all bitches. I was supposed to be in that house at the end of the day with them two by themselves and y'all overwhelmed them. Especially you had no business, no hands on them. So at the end of the day, that's why you got smacked. And then also you got smacked because when the bitch said she was going to cut me, that's that's no. dangerous as fuck. You she talked to her on the regular, that. so you knew her beforehand. Before y'all got on that bus, you knew what the fuck she was talking about. She was gonna do, no, like you know what I'm saying. Out. And then you laughed at it. At the end of the day, even when she clocked her, okay, all she can do is just sit there with that double chin, with that double neck, <clears throat> giving Peter Griffin, okay, with that founding father wig on. All right, I'm telling you, it look, it, it, it's given she was on the Mayflower. Biggie looking like a damn pilgrim with that wig on. You pull the scissors out, you still laugh at the shit. You think everything funny, but it was funny when you got smacked. It's always very, no, 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 very no, no. good. No, no, no. Biggie, like, first of all, you was ruined for us at one point, then you won at one point, another point, but then for who are you to jump in somebody's fight when you. I feel like she clocked her. All right. Somebody says J.O. fight so sloppy. While she definitely clocked the T, she also definitely was uh, still looking for a moment. Girl, they're on a TV show, especially a TV show that they barely gave her camera time. Everybody's looking for a moment. Shut up. What is that? What is up with these people talking about they looking for a moment? They looking for um clout. They're on a reality TV show. Everybody. I don't care what show is what it is. Real Housewives. Basketball Wives. Um... Uh, the Bachelor, you, you know what I mean? Flavor of Love, whatever, the love and hip hop. Everybody's looking for a moment. They're on a show for a reason. So y'all sound stupid when y'all say that. Shut up. Right, to say what we want. Uh, really, shut when up. you think about Fuck it. Up. Like, man, what, like, what, what more do you want from J.O.? What more do you want from me? <laughs> They damn that they do, damn that they don't. One minute is, oh, y'all don't recognize them. They didn't have a moment. They was barely on the show. So who are these people? Then when they get a moment and do do they thing, do they big one, whatever the case may be. Oh, they just looking for clout. They just looking for a big one. I mean, shut up. Just, just say that you a Biggie fan. Y'all be so protective about these people. I don't protect nobody. Y'all ain't notice that? I drag everybody. Nobody is safe. I don't have no favorites. I don't care. Okay? But once y'all once y'all start protecting people and defending people that really don't even need no damn defending, like, how can you defend Biggie? <clears throat> With Biggie's actions that we've seen on Baddies Caribbean going into Baddies Midwest, how can you defend all of this action, like, all of the effery that she be on? Just messy, loud, big, for nothing. Big mouth. Like, come on. All right, the cloud chasing narrative is so late and tired. Dub, bit that's what uh, they get paid to do. Exactly, exactly. Couldn't have said it any better myself. Okay, so here Biggie go again. <clears throat> Let me get my voice ready, y'all. We gotta, we gotta, we gotta say it in her voice. All right, y'all ready? Uh, I gotta get my, I, I gotta get my voice ready. All right. Uh. Nobody felt no way towards me until the reunion, boo. Trying to get on to the next season, thinking that was going to help at the end of the day. I'm, I'm, I'm already on to the next bag. Next season, I don't pick, I, I don't pick up uh, three big bags since then. Uh, I'm doing great and, and, and paid. Uh, she, she thought she won the battle, but I won the war. I'm going to always stand tall on how, feel, how, 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 how I feel, okay? Would y'all... Have rather me bite off more than I can chew and uh, end up with a messed up face. No, my supporters love me for who I am. I thank God for that top of, of for that top of all that. 
You mean on top of all that? Bro, y'all see I'm trying to read this, but it's not even making sense because the words just jumbling. Uh. Uh, so you saying you didn't fight her to mess up your face because you go mess up your face? Y'all, DTB was still doing bookings with a messed up tooth. I mean, with no tooth, right? Um, With a busted lip, black eye. Girl, just an excuse. Shut up. Just, man, just whack. So now you really just admit like I'm not fight. I'm just not fighting nobody because I'm not. I'm not about to mess up my face for, for, for my supporters. Not for, not for my supporters. You keep talking, man, and you shut the fuck up, huh? I know you don't. I know you don't believe that. I know you don't believe that. That's why I'm not jumping. That's why I just got it. Curse. If you don't get that bullshit out of my face, bitch. Uh, oh, uh, she said, uh, I, uh, I feel y'all would rather have me bite off more than I can chew and end up with a messed up face. No, my supporters love me for who I am. And I thank God for that top on top of all that. You get no points off that you snuck me. Nah, she didn't sneak you. She didn't sneak you while I was talking. Bye, brokey. I don't give a F. Y'all mad at me because I didn't do nothing back. I'm going to choose my face and my blood inside of my body every single time. Y'all failed to realize this is WWE. Oh. And my grandmama gave me that chain. That's all I hear. She all cry in the car. Beyonce said it best. Me, myself, and I is all I got in the end. That's what I found out. And there ain't no need to cry. To go bow that from now on, I'm going to be my own best friend. And cut. Uh, just throwing shade. Let's see what the comments say. J.O. owns a nice home. Uh, Owned a nice home uh, uh, before she got on baddies. Everyone isn't broke, Biggie. Talking too much. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's another thing, too. I don't like when people start getting money. All of a sudden, everybody broke. I don't get that. I I, I really don't understand that. Like, everybody not broke. That's what Krishan was doing to all her fans, too. Y'all know that. Y'all remember that? Calling everybody broke. Like, what the hell? I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. okay, anyways. What are you just on food? Set? Let me get out of there. Let me get out of there. Anyways. Um, why is she still on the show? And Tommy would have been uh, going off on Biggie because she kept screaming and crying about fighting back. Biggie, please. LMAO. Biggie knew J.O. was going to do her in, so she was just being scary, and now she owning it. I love that for her, but hate that for baddies. She don't need another season after Midwest. Can't be scary at the reunion after all the, uh, all she did during the season. Cast someone else. Thank you so much. I couldn't have said it any better myself. I get it, but I still don't let uh but still don't let nobody hit you and not do anything. That's simple. Girl, nobody needs to use you for clout. Thank you. I love Biggie, but she needs to humble up because what the F? Nah, boo. They was right. You been sneaking in uh everyone else beef but your own and ducked Jayla. She should have popped you firsthand. Biggie loved to be a victim, and we are tired of waiting on you. Yes. Biggie, you wasn't talking, babe. You seen uh you seen her come out and ease your way over to Tashiki for uh her to save you. You got hit because you kept jumping in just on it and hump just own it and humble yourself because you uh could be gone too. Girl, then uh keep your hands to yourself. You cool with sneaking though. Bye, Biggie. Baddies ain't uh for you then. Thank you. And I blame y'all fans for letting Biggie get soft. She wasn't like this on Baddies West, right? I saw when she slapped Smiley. I saw uh, when she was fighting Stunner. I don't know what the hell happened to her. All right? It, it, it's so weird, man. It's so weird. Um, But y'all know J.O. got to respond. J.O. ain't about to let this... You know, she ain't going to let this slide, okay? She is not going to let this slide. So let's see what J.O. got to say. J.O. says, Girl, you did all that jumping people on the season... Now you playing victim? When Nunu was fighting DTB, you had no reason to touch her, but you did. When you could, uh, when you could have just caught the fade for a little cigarette, but you didn't. Uh oh, she talking about Anna Mac. Uh, uh, my bad, Little Mac. Um, 
uh, my bad, uh, uh, Timon, um, um, a chicken, all right, uh, Pinky from Pinky in the Brain. Um, what else, y'all? We got so many damn names. Um, Ren from Ren and Stimpy. Um, and didn't you sneak Bianca too? Girl, pick a side. Uh oh. Uh oh. Moral of the story I'm gonna ride for my bees like y'all ride for y'all's. And you still doing the same inch this season when you didn't even fight back. But you wanna fight little people? I'm gonna hit your at again. Believe that. Hey, do us a favor and uh bring J.O. on the baddies uh Midwest reunion just because I want to see something. All right. Look at her slapping smiley. She said, where was this biggie people? She didn't know you was going to hit her, but you knew I was going to hit you. I told you online before the reunion, and that's why you told Tashiki to say nobody can't hit you. Uh oh. I feel like she clocking T. I mean, I, I I feel like she clocking T. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bitch. Okay. Uh, Biggie, Biggie is scared. Yes. Scary as hell for no damn reason. This how uh Biggie reacted when J.O. came on stage. Oh, I'm so tired of Biggie, y'all. Like, girl, please let this be your last season. Just, just, just let this be your last season because we tired. Dig back, dig back, dig back, dig back. Down my back, you loaded up with snacks and different foods. Squeeze into this tiny shirt, my big back has no room. Okay, anyways, um, now we got to get into this Tashiki and Big Kiva beef. Now, um, a lot of people was trying to drag me when i put out the uh you know i kind of put it out there that tashiki was scared to fight big kiva right and people were dragging me because they was like there's no way tashiki is scared of big kiva if anything big kiva is scared of tashiki and i said well two things can be right at the same time i said they didn't want to fight each other how about that how about that remember on the show when tashiki uh was being on a mat guard dog like she always is you know, Big Kiva dra had to drag DTB. Uh, Tashiki was like, ain't nobody touching on a Mac. And if, you, you know, blah, blah, blah. Basically, if you want it, you know, you can get, come get it. Well, Tashiki, you, uh, all you had to do was swing on her. All you had to do was like, like, what's up? Did you really want to fight? Nobody, nope, nope. Nobody parked each other. You feel me? Nobody swang. And same thing happened at the reunion, right? Big Key, uh, Tashiki was like, you want to fight? Blah, blah, blah. Big Kiva was like, man, I love you. You know, it's all love. Blah, blah, blah. But she didn't swing. Nobody swing. All right? So they didn't want to fight each other. Okay? They did it. Y'all be the judge. Okay? It says Tashiki and Big Kiva almost throw bows after Kiva explains to Tashiki that she feel like Tashiki doesn't really like her. You ain't been fucking with me. You, you back up. Bro. You back up. Bro. You back you up. Wanted, you, know, you, you ain't fucking with me. You want it? You back up. Like I said, you got a problem with me or you don't. I think you never like had to do like me. And then you, because you know I love you. I think you know that. And then you. Bro, if you love me, if you love me, then what the fuck is going on? Do you understand what I'm saying? We love each other. Everybody that loves me is. Are you with me? So, um, they doing a lot of yelling. That don't look like two people that's ready to fight. You said, uh, you think if uh, Tashiki would have fought. Kiva, Joe would have jumped in. Um, that's a possibility. 
That's a possibility. But to be honest with y'all, I've been saying they need to jump to Shiki. The She Hulk is not human. Y'all know that, right? She is she is from the X-Men. Okay. Um, y'all talking about Krishan went to a private school. No, Tashiki went to a private school. You know what it is? Her professor was Professor Xavier. Okay, Professor X. What was the school called, y'all? X-Men school. Hold on. It's called um Xavier School of Gig of Gifted Youngsters. All right. The Xavier School for Gifted Youngsters is a special institute uh, founded and led by Professor Charles Xavier to train young mutants in controlling their powers. Yeah, that's where uh, the She-Hulk went. That's where the She-Hulk went, y'all. Okay, she, she, she went to, um, you know, the, the gifted school for mutants. All right, she got she got super strength. Okay. Um, she has a uh, superhuman healing abilities. Okay, so she know how to take a punch. She know how to do her damage. Okay, damage, damage. I thought that I should let you know. T she ho cause damage, cause damage, cause damage. All right, come on, man. All right, let me. I gotta know. What are you gonna do, baby? Cause she gonna cause some damage. We saw, we saw what she did to DTB. Y'all saw that big ass knot on the head of uh Marsh. Okay, she caused damage. Hospital bills, emotional distress. Okay. Anyways, I'm done. I'm scared of her. I told you I'm. Sc- I'm a man. I'm scared of Tashi Hulk. I'm scared. I'm pressing everything. I'm pressing charges. I'm suing everybody. All right. Tashi Hulk touch me. I'm suing Tashi Hulk. I'm, I, I'm suing Zeus, Lemmy, Natalie. I, I'm suing Krishan Jr. I'm suing the baby. I'm suing the million dollar baby. Everybody getting sued. I'm Oprah. You getting sued. You getting sued. You getting sued. All right. All right. I said it. Okay. Anyways, I don't think that Tashiki wanted to fight. This is a lot of talking to me. This don't seem like somebody that's that's just want to fight. All right. They should just take off. All right. Somebody says if I tell a ho to bag up and she, and she stepped forward and asked me do I need that I'm socking her so yeah Kiva ducked her taco and she was uh, on live popping it I, I gotta admit I, I would have did the same thing too personally speaking but they don't they didn't want to fight each other I'll leave it at that I said what I said either one of them could have swung they in each other face they they both could have swung Kiva is all talk she didn't need that for real um the only thing that pisses me off is that she was all on go with Biggie, but when a, a real fighter asking if she need that, she uh talking about she love her, ignoring the question and just uh going outside. Ain't no picking and choosing. Keep the same energy and square up. Well, why y'all don't keep the same energy with Biggie then? I don't get it. Y'all like to bring up size too. Y'all never bring up size when it's slim and rolly. I mean, Tashiki asking multiple times if they were uh, fighting or, or if she wanted to fight and Kiva standing there confessing her love. Yeah. I actually liked uh, the fact that Tashiki at least expressed what her issue is with Kiva, which was valid. She could have easily just started swinging on her to prove a point, which I feel like she should have. Y'all give like all this, all this arguing and oh, do you want to fight me? No, well, you don't want to fight me. Well, do you want to fight me? You know. I don't know. You said she didn't want to fight. Yeah, I'm, I'm saying both of them didn't want to fight. Now, they was dragging me for saying that. That's an unpopular opinion because we all know that Tashiki is the eater, right? But I, I feel like both of them didn't want to fight. All right? I feel like both of them didn't want to fight. Um, You said... uh. You said Marsh and Jan are small too. No one says anything to Tashiki about size. That's a good point. That's a good point. 
I wish Tashiki was my man to protect me, and I don't even swing that way. But come over, man. Uh, you just gotta hire for security purposes, okay? You gotta hire for security uh, purposes. But um, y'all know that Jo is gonna defend uh Big Kiva, okay? And um, uh, vice versa. Well, so Big Kiva got something to say. Check this out. Check this out. So she posted a story. OK, and this is obviously the, the situation that's happening. We looked at it and Big Kiva reposted it. So look, somebody says, J.O. sis, I just have one question. If things would have went left between Kiva and uh, Tashiki, were you on that uh, with your friend? Because that's the energy I picked up from watching it, which I love, by the way. You didn't leave Kiva side once. I, I, I think she probably would have jumped in. She told me to move and she tried to take the fade for me. I told her, no, they cut it out. Oh, that's what Big Kiva saying. It's her story, y'all. Okay, so she's saying that J.O. wanted the fade and they cut that part out. Oh, she told me to move and she tried to take the fade for me. I told her, no, they cut it out. Y'all know what they be doing with the reunion. We didn't get the raw cut. We got the edited version. So I can believe that. I can believe that. That that's crazy. I can believe that. Oh. That's crazy. I don't think Jo was scared of nobody. I'm so tired of Kiva. Like, girl, they done filmed a whole new season, and you still going on? It's over. Go back to the unknown. To be unknown. Oh my lord. Well, you got to say that about everybody that's still been popping in. They not on the new season. Et. Uh, Mariah Lynn. Camilla, who ain't been on a damn show in two, three seasons. Um, Meatball, uh, Smiley. Like, I mean, what that's stupid. Like, come on. We we keep that same energy. Y'all only say this about people that y'all don't like. We keep that same energy for everybody. You need to tell everybody to stop talking about baddies then. Okay. All right. Everybody. Um, it's always the eaters that never want to eat each other. <laughs> That sound crazy. I think I got I, I think I got a just a dirty mind to something because that was wild. Pause. You ain't gonna under, understand everything. And everything ain't meant for you to understand. Anywho, um J.O. and Kiva ducked uh that fade, they came out screaming. They want to fight whoever wanted. Uh, Tashiki asked Kiva, did she need that? Nobody said ish. Kiva kept saying, get back. Well, she just said that she cut it out that uh, um, J.O. wanted the fade. Did she not just say J.O. said that she uh, would take the fade with Tashiki, but they edited it out? Neither one of them ducked anything. Right. All right. J.O. was mugging the F out of Tashiki. Trust me, Tashiki wanted that smoke with J.O. You can, uh, you can tell Kiva uh right they cut jo part out because the way jo was circling tashiki with that mug on her face she wanted uh she she asked kiva if she wanted to fight that's what i'm saying and remember um they said that kiva and um jo got kicked off the uh kicked out the reunion did y'all forget that like people people got people like to remember what they want to remember let me see if i can check this out real quick let's see if we can find it all right, uh, um, Kiva Baddies Reunion. It's so far, it's so long ago, man. What's this like a couple months ago now, y'all? Um, when they showed, um, remember Big Kiva went on, remember Big Kiva went on live, she went on live at the reunion and said, you know, thank you and stuff, but remember, she got kicked off. She she said that they got kicked out. Hold on, man. Was it on YouTube? Uh, Kiva kicked out reunion. Kicked out reunion. Come on, man. Y'all know I got a good memory. Come on, man. Stop playing it. It's a lot of stuff that we didn't see. Come on. This is great tea giving you the late tea. Let's go. 
All right, come on. I forget nothing. You know what? Yeah. Shout out to Saucy Santana, bitch. Make a bitch stand on business. Period. <laughs> bitch. Shout out to Saucy Santana. We love you, bitch. We love you. Now you're Period. Real we fucking love you. Period. You a real one. You Regardless of what, how the shit went, Carolina. we Carolina. fucks with Period. you. I fuck with you. Yeah. 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 I'm going to make this quick, short and simple, because my voice is out. So I ain't trying to do too much rapping. I just find it funny that a live audience can kind of, you know, verbally attack cast members that not be escorted out, um, not be warned, not be told to stop, things like that. But when a cast member, I'm a fucking cast member, whether it's reserved or not, whether who you fuck with or not, bitch, I'm still here. And as soon as I say something, motherfucker don't like this, get her up out of here. Then motherfuckers try to bring me back. Somebody, yeah, bring her back. No, you got to stand on putting me off the stage because you, you ain't had no reason to really put me off the stage. All I'm saying is shit. So what y'all bring us in, fuckers, motherfuckers over now. Motherfuckers trying to stop motherfuckers from fighting, basically. Um, so, how y'all, we only been out here 15 minutes. Y'all brought us out for nothing. Oh, wrapping it up. We wrapping it up. It's over. No, what? So, yeah, I feel some type of way. So, I'm like, damn, what y'all think we some goofies or something? <laughs> so, who said that? Get up out of here. What? And you know what? I'm going to say this and be done with it. God don't like ugly. He ain't too fond of pretty either. That's why shit went how it went. Lee, let me tell you something. Motherfucker tried to take me out the game. Let me tell you something. God himself came down and said, you know what? Keep it. Don't worry about it. I got it. Exit. <laughs> Motherfucker's back hurt. No, no. You feel me? But hey, like I said, that's why shit happened how it happened. Motherfucker still stood on business. Definitely call bitches out. Motherfuckers not trying to fight G. And I wasn't making nobody fight, bitch. But motherfuckers end up still getting smacked up. Bitches that still stand on business. And then we stood on business. Period. Period. Shout out to all my supporters. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, motherfuckers play with his squad, though. Like, yeah. Like, bringing us out for the last 15 minutes, 20 minutes is crazy. Especially me and Nuna. Bitch, we last to the end. What? What's this? A joke? Am I wrong? And it's all love. I ain't mean no disrespect. But I'm like, damn, what y'all think? We some goofies or something? I literally was thinking out loud. Man, brought them out for the last 15 minutes and then got kicked out. That's crazy. That's crazy. Uh, so you know, I, I, I believe the story. I believe the story. J JO was keeping that energy. JO was keeping that energy. Um, somebody said, Well, from the post, Kiva uh said JO accepted the fate on her behalf, but Kiva didn't let her. Uh, why is she still going, bro? I don't know why y'all have all this energy at the reunion. It's no point in talking. Uh, but it, man, no, my uh, people can't. I can't read this stuff. Uh, Jo was so indirect. If she wanted that, she would have said it. She ain't want it. She said they cut it out. Yeah, these people are slow, y'all. These people are slow. They're telling them stuff and everything, and then they they just keep their own narrative. But let me remind y'all, bro, when school was over, when high school was done, they just freed all the special ed kids out into the world, didn't tell us who was who or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Our whole lives in school, we were separated. We knew who were who. We knew, all right, they get the tripping, don't even pay them no mind, they special ed, you know what I'm saying? After high school, they let them out into society, and we don't know, bro. So when somebody trying, you just remember, they probably them. That's probably them right there, bro. Anywho, anywho, let's get into this uh baddies Midwest T. All right, yes, all that's crazy, y'all. We've been covering, we still talking about baddies Caribbean, but obviously because part three just you know uh premiered of the of the reunion yesterday, but you know it's still crazy that it's literally so much beef still going on. Okay, and I don't think this is gonna stop because they can easily bring these girls, you know, rotate these girls into new seasons and stuff. So. Just hear me out. I don't think the whole... I don't think we've seen the last of Big Kiva and J.O. Okay? I don't think... I don't think we've seen the last of Big Kiva and J.O. I'll just... I'll just keep it at that.